Welcome back, everybody. Now it's time for your favorite time of the night, our top plays of the week. Devin, let's start with number five, North Carolina against Y High. And Corey Bunce scrambling left finds Jackson Kahn down at the five yard line. Great diving grab there. But the Bulldogs go on to lose this game. Now we got to go to number four, Seaford versus Early College. Now, a screen pass, you, I guess, was the play of the day today. A couple teams did it. And uh, also the handoff right there. Look at that, 45 yards. Brandon West takes it all the way to the house on touch. Blue Jays went big over Early College. And uh, that was a big win for Seaford as they've taken a, a few lumps this year. And now at number three, we've got Easton Ken Island. Mike O'Connor out to chase Rob there. Makes the catch on his head. Warriors win big over the Bucks. That might have been the biggest win of the night. Yeah, that definitely was for them. Now we got to go number two, Smyrna versus Apo Quinnemick. This is where I was talking about the screen pass. It's got to be one of the two Phoenix Enrique plays. Yeah, he was really great today, even though his team didn't win. Didn't matter for him personally, because look at that. 77 yards. And this untouched. kid is one of the fastest guys in the entire I mean, MLS he looked college. at it. He was running away from that defense like a, a – I can't even think of the analogy. Smyrna That's how had fast a good wall running. in front, but he definitely made that play happen. Number one, Woodbridge Central. Watch this diving grab by Jakir Banks at the back of the end zone. Huge play for Woodbridge. Unfortunately, Central goes on to win that one, 31-14. All right, stick around. Your WMDT Sports Athlete of the Week is coming up next. You're watching DSI. Hi, this is Lindsay Underwood with Cape Henlopen Women's Lacrosse, and you're watching Delmarva Sports Insider.